south coast of Devon at Axminster Tools. And I was here five years ago. Jay, you have not changed a bit in five years. You really haven't. I mean, you've got more machines though. You're in a totally different building. Yeah, much bigger premises now, yeah. Yeah, it's exciting. It is. So for anyone that doesn't know, what is it that you produce here at Axminster Tools? Uh, predominantly it's wood turning accessories, but now we're doing more kits uh, for wood routing and for people to build jigs and fixtures. And you're clearly expanding and oh, yeah. doing well. Yeah, so we're just doing more and more of it. Why have you gone for the SX38? Uh, because it has a turret and you can do a lot of overlap machining. So balance milling, balance turning. Uh, you can mill on the sub with the turret and, and also do long, like deep drilling. And also having the third said free axis helps a lot with more complicated parts. Once you've machined it away, you've got no support in the guy bush. But with, with the extra turret uh, that comes in and out, you can. So is it right? In, am I right in thinking you're making more complex components? We are, yeah. With Ian's book, it, his ideas just get more complicated. Ian's so the owner, by the way. He is. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So what? What's? Why is he making more complex? Uh, he's trying to bring more back uh, from China and Taiwan, mostly, and also innovating new products. He's coming up with brand new ideas. Really exciting! exciting. Oh, brilliant! Right, thank you. I want to go see some of the team members now that are using these machines. Right, Nathan. Now, Jake's told me you were obsessed with programming. Is that correct? Yes, yeah, sounds a bit sad, but yeah. <laughs> no, yeah. it's not sad really at all. Way. In way. a really good way. Uh, so, what's your role here then? So, production engineer. So, I oversee the stars, um, Gone Masix as well, but predominantly the stars, which is writing programs, um, improving them. And then how does that link in with Jake's job then? So what does he yeah. do overall? Jake works in like, product development. So he'll prove out a prototype, um, make changes where they're needed, and then I productionize them. Why did you go for this model? Predominantly the fact you can have three tools in cut at any one point. So you can have tool and cut on the platen there, tool and cut on the turret, and then once you're back working on the back breaking station there. But alongside that, you can use the turret on the back end on the subspin mill. So yeah, I mean, your overlap machining is, is greatly improved because you have um, essentially three machines rather than just two and then you're back working on the subsystem there you've got more flexibility you know if you can turn an OD on the platen and drill simultaneously on the turret then you know you're, you have two operations down to one um, obviously if you're balance you're balance milling you know you're machining a hex that's three passes rather than six so just three sorts of cut predominantly that's how we've had such a side time so so tell me about more features on the machine that you're liking and kind of helping with your your day-to-day -day job. So set cycle throw is quite a big one for me. Yes. We do a lot of 6082 aluminium. Um, just trying to get that to chip. It's always been a bit of a nightmare. We do have HFT, but I find step cycle pro, you know, rather than doing loads of small cuts using HFT and having a dwell, we can do one deep cut with step cycle pro, we get a perfect chip and the part is tenfold faster. In addition to that, we've got the BX up over there. So we have four stations at ER20. Um, the axis is supposed to top and bottom there, so much more rigid for heavy milling applications. To be honest, Nathan, you know, you've gone from star to star to star to star. The support's got to be good, but why is it? How well supported are you? The apps guys, you know, I don't have time for all of them. Um, Chaz, Nick, Ben. Chaz especially, the SX Master. I had a program course with him about four years ago on another yeah. machine. It was just one-on-one -on -one a week, and that course really have my eyes for what you can do in these machines with free tools and cut um how to balance programs yeah it's brilliant i think the world needs more nathans we won't quite go that far <laughs> anyway thank you for going thank on you. camera and you. hopefully i'll be back here again in another five years with five more, more stars. yeah exactly five more stars i like that good goals yeah